Hello, my name is Manjad Singh. I'm Lead Enterprise Architect at MariaDB, and I'm here to talk to you about InnoDB durability, and specifically the variable InnoDB flush log at TRX commit. This variable controls the durability in ACID compliance. ACID compliance, as you may know, stands for atomicity, consistency, isolation, and durability. So specifically this durability versus performance. And there is a bit of a trade-off when you look at this variable. The possible values for this variable are 0, 1, and 2. So let's take a look at what these mean for us. So we'll write them down on the side here. And we'll take a look at how they affect things. The specific path of a query goes through the InnoDB buffer pool. We'll put BP here. Then the log buffer from the InnoDB redo logs. The OS buffer. And then finally to the log file. So let's start with zero. When InnoDB flush log at transaction commit, sometimes called IFLACT for the initials, uh, is set to zero, you do a write and it goes through memory, through the buffer pool, into the log buffer. After that, that write is then flushed from the log buffer all the way to the log file on disk every one second or when the OS flushes. If you set it to one, which is maximum durability, your write goes to the log buffer. So again, this is your write and commit. But the commit of the file ensures that it is written all the way on disk with every one transaction. If we set it to two, this is sort of a trade-off. So one will have quite a bit of a performance hit uh, as compared to zero. Zero means it just writes, it's in memory, etc. cetera. Uh, what two will do is write to the log buffer but that file will actually be committed all the way to the OS buffer. And then, at some point, the OS will flush to disk approximately every one second. So what are the advantages and disadvantages here? Well, when it's set to zero, if the database crashes, the log buffer within memory will get lost, and you have a chance of losing that transaction. So that can be bad. So you've lost a bit of durability, but you've gained quite a bit of performance. If you set it to one, every write is for sure written to the redo log on disk. You do not lose that write regardless of the crash. What does two give you? Two is a good compromise. You get almost um, about 75% performance boost. So you only lose about 25% performance as compared to one. Um, and if the database crashes, you can see it's still written to disk. Well, at least the disk cache and then written to disk later on. But if the database server crashes, that database's OS disk buffer has a chance of losing data. Now, this is negated if you have battery back backup. You might have a SAN. Um, and in that case, your disk is safe. So two is a great compromise if you have that battery backed RAID um, or SAN, uh, or something of that nature, and the, um, the, the database crashes or, or even the entire server crashes. Uh, so that's basically InnoDB flush log at TRX commit and how it works. Thank you.